Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. You already know what time it is. Today, we're diving into a subcompact crossover that's what we're making some noise for 2025. And nope, it's not about jacked up prices. That's right, we're talking about the 2025 Kia Nero. And this year, Kia has decided to keep the price tag pretty much the same. All right, so the 2025 Kia Nero comes in three flavors, hybrid plug-in, hybrid, PHEC, and all electric EV. While we're still waiting on the official EV pricing, Kia has dropped the numbers for the hybrid and plug-in hybrid versions. And guess what? They're barely up from last year. I'm talking about a $50 bump for the hybrid and a $100 increase for the PHEV. How often do we see a brand hold prices so close to the previous year? Pretty rare, right? The hybrid version starts at $28,365, which is just a $50 jump from 2024 not bad meanwhile the plug-in hybrid will set you back thirty five thousand eight hundred and sixty five dollars up by one hundred dollars the top of the line nero hybrid as sx touring that one starts at thirty six thousand six hundred and seventy five dollars just a forty dollars difference even the pehev's top spec only rose by three hundred and fifty dollars to forty two thousand one hundred and sixty five dollars Honestly, for a car packed with this much tech and efficiency, these price adjustments are barely noticeable. Kia is giving us some solid options here with the Nero Hybrid. Apart from the, uh, the base LX trim, you've got the mid-tier EX at $31,165, the EX Touring at $33,465, and the SX at $34,365, and get this. Each of those uh, trims only cost between $50 and $150 more than their 2024 counterparts. It's like Kia is keeping it real with their uh, pricing while still giving us more features for the, the new model year. Now, under the hood, things get interesting. Every hybrid Nero comes with a 139 horsepower powertrain, which is pretty solid for everyday driving and fuel economy. But if you need a little more power, the PHIVV version cranks it up with 180 horses. Plus, the PHEV gives you about 30 miles of electric only range on a full charge. That's perfect for short commutes or running errands around town without burning a drop of gas. So, what's new for 2025, you ask? Kia has added a couple of upgrades that are worth mentioning. First off, every Nero now comes with rear seatbelt pretensioners for added safety. And if you're thinking about uh, getting the PHEV version, you're in for a treat. Uh, the cold weather package, which includes heated rear seats and a more efficient uh, PTC heater is now standard. So in a world where car prices seem to skyrocket every year, the 2025 Kia Nero is staying humble. It's affordable, packed with features and uh, efficient uh, as ever. Whether you're eyeing the hybrid or the PHE blah, it's hard to argue against the value you're getting here. Thanks for watching. Be sure to uh, hit, or hit that like button, subscribe for more car reviews, and drop a comment below. What uh, what do you think about the 2025 uh, Nero's minimal price hikes? Uh, catch you all in the next one.